Hi guys, welcome back to another tutorial. Today, I'll show you the step-by-step -step procedure for topping up in Naruto Mobile. As you all know, this game is heavily pay to win, so you'll need to top up to get VIP status, royal passes, paid ninjas, skins, elements, and many other paid items. Let's get started. This video is for Android users only, so if you're on iOS, this tutorial isn't for you. The first step is to complete real name authentication. You cannot recharge in the game unless you are verified. My friend Shisui has made a detailed video explaining the entire procedure, so check out his video. I'll leave the link in the description as well. Now, after you're verified, you need to understand how the top-up works. You can only top up in the game using Chinese currency, Yuan or QQ coins. QQ coins and Yuan are the same thing, so no need to be confused. The two methods I'm going to show you in this video are 1. QQ cards and 2. Direct purchase. At the end of this video, I'll tell you how these two options are different. First, let's talk about QQ cards. This option is for those who don't have a QQ account. Basically, it's a recharge card that you can use to top up in the game. Let me show you how it works. You can go to any website, just search on Google. I use CAGM because it's the cheapest option I have found. What you need to do is buy these cards, but don't buy the ones that ask for a QQ number because those are for QQ accounts, which I'll cover later in the video. When you buy a QQ card, it'll give you a card number and password. Copy that and go to the game. Then click on the blue option. It'll show you two boxes. Put the card number in the first one and the password in the second, and you're done. The second method is direct purchase. This option is for those who already have a QQ account. The most common question people ask me is, do we have to have our game account on QQ as well? The answer is no. You can top up in the game with a QQ account even if your game account is on WeChat. That's what I've been doing ever since I made a QQ account. Here's how it works. You need to enter your QQ ID and purchase Yuan, which will be directly transferred to your QQ wallet. After that, go into the game and click on the yellow penguin icon. From there, just keep clicking next without changing anything and your top up is done. Simple as that. Now the game isn't the only place where you can buy stuff. Let me show you another way. Open WeChat and search for pay.qq.com. Once you're there, look for the Naruto game. You can also buy things here, and sometimes this method gives you bonuses as well. For example, 50 yuan worth of green stones will give you 75 bonus stones on this site, while in-game it gives only 65. Also, this site sometimes has items available for purchase that aren't in the game yet. For example, some characters may not be in the game right now, but will be released next week. This is also where you can buy the Royal Pass pre-order. I'll make a separate video about that when it comes out. Now, let's talk about the downside of QQ cards. The maximum value of a QQ card is 120 yuan. So if you have a card, you can't buy the 648 yuan option. Also, if you've bought a 60 yuan card, you can buy 50 yuan worth of items, but then you'll have 10 yuan left. The minimum amount you can spend in the game is 6 yuan, so if you buy something for 6 yuan, you'll have 4 yuan left on the card, which is basically useless. To avoid this, you can buy 6 yuan items 10 times to use up the entire amount. Additionally, if you have 100 yuan and buy a 98 yuan item, you'll have 2 yuan left, which you can't use. In that case, it's better to buy 50 yuan items twice so that none of the money is wasted. You also can't use QQ cards to buy the 198 yuan royal pass. You can only buy smaller amounts, like 25 yuan at a time. As for QQ account users, there's no limit to how much you can top up. I only made this video for Android because I use Android myself and don't know how it works on iOS. If anyone has any more questions, you can reach out to me through Instagram. The link is in the description. And that's all for this video.